Kumar Sudhir, just a final comment from you. If the results do indeed go TTV Denakaran's way, and it is just initial rounds as of now, can Chinnamma, his mother, claim to be the rightful heir of Amma? <laughs> The victory of Fahad Dinakaran should be attributed to multiple factors here, Rohit. One is the personality of TTV Dinakaran himself. He has been, uh, in a sense, uh, uh, more forthcoming and he has been seen as uh, someone who could handle the media, who was able to articulate his viewpoint very well, whereas Madhusudanan as well as Marud Ganesh of the DMK were not seen as uh, candidates who could really uh, hold uh, themselves uh, up very well in front of the audience. Of course, there has been a lot of money play once again uh, in this election, despite yes. the fact that the previous election was cancelled because there was so much of money exchanged even this time round we saw voters very openly saying that they received money they received cash and in fact uh, uh, what would seem an interesting comment someone uh, telling me that you know Dinakaran spent 4,000 last time this, thousand, this time again he's spending some 6,000 and therefore he does deserve our right. vote so money did play a part in this entire uh, uh, play out of uh, politics in, Tam uh, in RK Nagar but the more important implication is for the state politics will the AIA deal headed by EPS OPS be able to continue in government if MLAs once again shift right. to priorities that is the first question second is for the 2019 elections ahead of the 2019 elections we have to look at what uh, the BJP is going to do now because they have very openly backed the EPS OPS government in a sense uh, seem to have had the blessings of the EPS OPS government yes. and unwittingly the BJP may have actually helped Dinakaran because in a sense that many in many places in RK Nagar you would have heard this about how Dinakaran right. was the only one who was right, able to stand up to a BJP and therefore will the BJP now start warming up to a DMK uh, uh, ahead of the right. 2019 elections, we already saw the Prime Minister go and visit Karnanidhi yes. at his residence in November. That is something that uh, we will wait and watch.